guys, welcome to New by Design. Today I'm going to be doing a video here on Destiny, and this is going to be the new Queen's Wrath bounties that came out on version update 1.2.0 that came out May 15th. You're going to see we're going to be focusing on the Wanted Pecus the Disallowed, or Disavowed, sorry. And we're going to go ahead and show you how to get to the Citadel area here. So right off the hop, when you land on Venus, you're going to head to the left, you're going to go right up to this area, and then you are going to follow to the right here, and really that is all there is. Once you take this right-hand turn here, you're basically just following a path, there is no other way to go, and this is going to spawn like every single one of these other quests here you're going to see you're going to hang out in this area until the ship comes in like a public event however this public event never does spawn in this area so this is going to be kind of new in that respect but it's still going to be the same as all the other events you're going to kill wave after wave after wave of these mobs here eventually you're going to get to pecus here the disavowed and you are going to go ahead and kill them then there's going to be a chest that spawns like they all do and once that happens, then you can pick up your loot if you can find it. I, I do end up finding it here again, or I should say somebody else ends up finding it and pointing to it so that everybody else can go to them. And when that happens, then everybody ends up getting the chest. That's a good thing to do. So if you guys happen to find it, make sure you do that because it does draw attention to it. And everybody else that helped you make this kill will be there with you. So you can see we're just going to keep on killing on wave after wave of these. And there is going to be quite a few. I think, again, there's about five waves because you can see there's about five or six of us here. Again, I don't know specifically if the wave are determined by how many people are here but it seems like when you have a lot more people there are more waves that end up happening that said I've only done four of these so far two of the same one on one character which was both low amount of people and this uh, last two here that I did, and there was a lot of people in them, which is great because it's going to be easier, obviously, to get these when there is a lot of people playing, and that's going to happen kind of the first couple days this comes out. You can see, even though I said I had my Gallahorn out the last two times I did this, I was actually using Hunger Crota. Now I actually have my Gallahorn out. I don't even know why. You know, I was just blind to it. I was so focused on what was happening that I was completely oblivious to the fact that there was no wolf pack rounds and the fact that it looked completely different. Either way, guys, you can see... The boss has finally spawned just to my right here, and I will start going ahead and killing him there with everybody else, and we'll actually start shooting some Gallahorn rounds at him here, and that will end up taking him down a lot faster, which is great, and I think another guy here has some pretty decent weapons he's using as well. So you can see that's it, guys. We ended up finishing it off here, and we are going to run and open the chest. Not going to do the whole video of running to it there, but we're going to go ahead and open this chest, and then we are going to go ahead and return it, and we will be 750 uh, or three quarters of the way into to rank one which is going to be fantastic hoping to get rank uh, one completed today but that's all there is in this video here guys if you guys enjoyed this video or found it useful at all it sure would help me a lot if you guys would click that like button also if you guys have time you can hit that bright yellow subscribe button just in the center there that'll notify you every time i publish a new video thanks very much for watching guys